We look forward to having you on our YouTube channel as we investigate the controversy surrounding the question, Is Jesus Christ God? Welcome. In this enlightening video, we will examine multiple biblical viewpoints in order to clarify this important theological controversy. We must first acknowledge the human side of Jesus Christ in order to better appreciate the argument. Jesus made himself nothing, taking the very nature of a servant, being made in human likeness, as stated in Philippians chapter 2, verse 7. This passage highlights the fact that he took on human form and was therefore subject to human emotions, experiences, and limitations. Jesus was entirely human, yet the Bible also shows that he also possessed divine qualities. The beginning was the Word, and the Word was with God, and the Word was God, as stated in John chapter 1, verse 1. This text implies that Jesus Christ is the Word, and that He is the eternal Word of God. When we consider Jesus' own words, the argument becomes more heated. Jesus declared, I and the Father are one, in John chapter 10, verse 30. People who heard this speech were divided over it because... They questioned his claim of being one with God the Father. Additionally, Jesus hinted at his divine nature when he said to Philip in John chapter 14, verse 9, Anyone who has seen me has seen the Father. The argument is further fueled by the disciples' testimonies. In John chapter 20, verse 28, Thomas cried, My Lord and my God, after seeing the crucified and raised Jesus. In Colossians chapter 2, verse 9, the Apostle Paul also confirmed Jesus' deity, writing, For in Christ all the whole of deity lives in bodily form. The complicated doctrine of the Trinity, which holds that God is actually composed of three distinct persons, God the Father, God the Son, Jesus Christ, and God the Holy Spirit, is at the center of the argument. The Bible does not use the word Trinity specifically, but several texts make allusions to this divine mystery, such as Matthew 28, verse 19, where Jesus tells his disciples to perform baptisms in the name of the Father and of the Son and of the Holy Spirit. As we wrap up our examination of the question, is Jesus Christ God? In exploring the debate, we discover that the Bible has various viewpoints on the character of Jesus Christ. It respects his humanity while simultaneously providing strong proof of his deity. The controversy is made more complicated by the mystery of the Trinity, which encourages us to approach it with humility and respect for other people's beliefs. In the end, our quest to comprehend Jesus' dual nature as human and divine enhances our faith and inspires us to pursue a closer connection with God. Don't forget to hit the like button and share this video with others looking for answers to this crucial subject if you find it to be thought-provoking. For more enlightening videos, please subscribe to our channel. We appreciate you joining us and we wish you continued peace from God.